Hello friends, welcome back to Infigya. Today in this video, we are going to solve one very interesting question from trigonometry. We have to show that cot pi over 24 over root 3 plus root 2 minus tan pi over 24 over root 3 minus root 2 is equal to 2. So let's get started by writing here cot pi over 24. Now we know that cot theta is cosine theta over sine theta. So we can write cos pi over 24 over sine pi over 24. Now I will multiply our numerator and denominator by 2 cos pi over 24 so that we can apply double angle formula in the denominator. Now you can see if we will multiply these two terms we will get 2 sin theta cos theta. So we know that 2 sin theta cos theta this is equal to sin 2 theta. So we will write cot pi over 24 this will be equal to 2 cos a square pi over 24 over 2 sin theta cos theta we will write sin 2 theta so I will write sin of 2 times theta is pi over 24. Now 24 we will cancel by numerator 2 so denominator will become 12. So denominator in total is sin pi over 12. So I can write equal to 2 cos a square pi over 24 over sin pi over 12. Now we know cosine 2 theta formula. Cos 2 theta this is equal to 2 cos a square theta minus 1. So from this equation I can write 2 cos a square theta value. This will be equal to 1 plus cos 2 theta which we are going to apply here in the numerator. Here theta is pi over 24. So we will get 1 plus cos 2 times pi over 24 in the numerator. Let me write 1 plus cos 2 times pi over 24 and in denominator this was sin pi over 12 equal to cot pi over 24. Now we will cancel denominator 24 by numerator 2 value in the denominator will be 12. So I can write 1 plus cos pi over 12 over sin pi over 12. Now we will calculate cos pi over 12 and sin pi over 12. So I can write RHS 1 plus cos pi over 12. We will write pi over 3 minus pi over 4. If we will take LCM then 4 pi minus 3 pi will be in the numerator and denominator will be 12. So 4 pi minus 3 pi is pi, pi over 12. In denominator we will write in the similar way sin pi over 12 sin pi over 3 minus pi over 4. Now we are going to use two trigonometric powerful formulas. First one cos a minus b. This is equal to cos a cos b plus sin a sin b. And second formula for the denominator sin a minus b which will be equal to sin a cos b minus cos a sin b. So we are going to apply these two trig identities for our RHS. Let me write here. So we will write 1 plus cos a minus b cos a cos b. So cos pi over 3 
cos pi over 4 cos a cos b is done plus sin sin a sin b so sin pi over 3 sin pi over 4 this will be our numerator now the turn of denominator sin a minus b you will write sin a in place of a it is pi over 3 cos b in place of b it is pi over 4 minus cos a cos pi over 3 sin b sin pi over 4 now we have to apply all the values which we know 1 plus cos pi over 3 is cos 60 which is equal to half cos pi over 4 it is root 2 over 2 or we can write 1 over root 2 plus sin pi over 3 it is sin 60 we will write root 3 over 2 sin pi over 4 it is root 2 over 2 or we can write 1 over root 2 now the turn of denominator sin pi over 3 is sin 60 we will write root 3 over 2 cosine pi over 4 1 over root 2 minus cos pi over 3 is cos 60 which is equal to 1 over 2 and sin pi over 4 is 1 over root 2. Now we will take LCM in the numerator and denominator. We will get 2 root 2 plus 1 plus root 3 in the numerator over. In denominator we will write root 3 minus 1. Denominators numerator and numerators denominator. That, that will be over. So we will get finally 2 root 2 plus 1 plus root 3 in the numerator and root 3 minus 1 in the denominator. 2 root 2 will be cancelled out. Let me write here 2 root 2 plus 1 plus root 3 over root 3 minus 1. This is the value of cot pi over 24. Now we will take rationalization step. We will multiply here in the numerator and denominator by root 3 plus 1. Let's multiply. So we will write here root 3 plus 1 in the denominator also. In denominator we are getting a minus b times a plus b form. So here we can apply difference of two squares formula. Root 3 square minus 1 square value will be equal to 3 minus 1. So denominator will become 2. So I need to write here 2 root 2 plus 1 plus root 3 times root 3 plus 1 over 2. Now we are going to multiply this root 3 plus 1 both the terms of the other bracket. So we will write 2 root 2 times root 3 plus 1 in one term first term position plus root 3 plus 1 whole square over 2. Now we will apply a plus b whole square. So we can write here 2 root 2 times root 3 plus 1 plus root 3 plus 1 whole square. So root 3 square is 3, 1 square is 1, 3 plus 1 is 4. We can write 4 plus 2 times root 3 times 1, 2 root 3 and denominator is 2. Let's divide numerator terms with denominator 2. We will get root 2 times root 3 plus 1 plus 2 plus root 3. So I can write root 6 plus root 2 plus 2 plus root 3. Root 6 plus root 2 plus 2 plus root 3. This is equal to cot pi over 24. Now I can write root 6 plus root 3. And then I can write 2 plus root 2. Now from first two terms, root 3 we can take common. So in the bracket we will be getting root 2 plus 1. From last two terms, if we will take root 2 common out, so in the bracket we will retain the same terms root 2 plus 1. So factorization is done. 
it is root 2 plus 1 times root 3 plus root 2. Now you can see this is our first term of LHS. And if I will divide our equation by root 3 plus root 2 both sides, let's divide root 3 plus root 2. Here also we will divide by root 3 plus root 2. Now we can cancel these two brackets. So our value of cot pi over 24 over root 3 plus root 2 will be equal to root 2 plus 1. Let's say this is equation 1. Now we have to calculate the second term value means tan pi over 4 over root 3 minus root. So from this equation itself I will write the tan value. Tan is reciprocal of cot. So we will write tan pi over 24 value will be equal to 1 over root 2 plus 1 times root 3 plus root 2. Again we will rationalize our denominator here. So I will multiply root 2 minus 1 and root 3 minus root. This product we are multiplying in the numerator and denominator. So root 2 minus 1 times root 3 minus root. Now you can see if we will apply a square minus b square formula here as it is a plus b times a minus b form. We will get root 2 square minus 1 square value will be 1. Here also a plus b times a minus b form. We will apply difference of two squares formula root 3 square minus root 2 square value will be 3 minus 2 value 1. So denominator will be 1 times 1, 1. We can write tan pi over 4 will be equal to root 2 minus 1 times root 3 minus root 2. We will write tan pi over 24 value will be equal to root 2 minus 1 times root 3 minus root 2. Now you can see once we will divide both sides by root 3 minus root 2 we will be getting our second term of LHS. Let's divide by root 3 minus root both sides. Now we will cancel root 3 minus root 2 from RHS. So we will get our second equation tan pi over 24 over root 3 minus root 2 value is root 2 minus 1 equation is second. Now I have to only subtract second equation from first one. So I will write 1 minus 2 we will get cot pi over 24 over root 3 plus root 2. This was LHS of equation 1 minus tan pi over 24 over root 3 minus root 2. So I can write root 2 plus 1 RHS of equation 1 minus root 2 minus 1. So we will simplify RHS, we will get root 2 plus 1 minus root 2 plus 1. Plus and minus root 2 will be over. We will get our RHS 2. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.